Joe Daughtard star Ava Busby was attacked by the same culprit as Danielle Busby, the mom is not pleased by what happened. Danielle admitted to her followers she was livid. So, what happened to Ava and Danielle, are they okay? Danielle took to Instagram to share an update about Ava Busby. She shared two new photos of her daughter in a blue pastel two-piece swimsuit. She looked like she was enjoying herself by the pool. Ava was smiling brightly in the photos, you wouldn't think that she was attacked during that day. Danielle took to her Instagram post to reveal what happened. She said she was about to go mad by what happened to her daughter. This mama is about to go mad nuts. Ava was swimming and I assume the mama was to the one who stung me yesterday came out and stung Ava's ear while she was in the pool. I'm so livid. Danielle Busby wrote. But she is being a trooper. Hope it doesn't affect her like it did me. I was bothered by it for hours, even after trying all the things to help. Look at her poor ear, already swelling. Ava Busby's ear looks red and swollen. But, she's being a good trooper about it. She still had a good time with her sisters even though she got stung, fans took to the post to share well wishes. Get well soon Ava, hope it doesn't hurt. One fans commented. Bless her heart. She is a tough cookie, sending you all lots of love, she's so strong. Another fan added. Apparently, Ava Busby wasn't the only victim. Danielle revealed she also got stung by a wasp earlier, this happened long before Ava got stung. And then, she said her husband Adam Busby came home, he killed the wasp's nest. But, then the wasps sought the revenge. One of them stung Ava while the girls were in the pool. Both Ava and Danielle were attacked by the same culprit. It's no wonder why Danielle was so angry about what happened. She hoped that would have put the end to the madness over the wasp situation. Unfortunately, it caused more harm since her daughter got hurt. On other hand, Danielle Busby shares a bait on growing baby boy. Fans may be confused about her baby boy. No, she didn't have another child, at least not a real one. Danielle considers her boutique to be her baby. In fact, she named it Greason Big Boutique because Greason was the name she chose if she ever had a son. While she never did get her son, she did get six beautiful daughters. The family also has two male dogs, Bose and Gus. Danielle shared on her social media months ago that the boutique is expanding from an online-only retail store to a physical storefront in Texas where the family lives. Now she shared a glimpse at how much work they've put into the space since buying it. Danielle took to the Grease and B Instagram account to share a series of videos of the progress so far. At this point, Danielle has yet to share an opening date for the Grease and B storefront. However, she will likely continue updating fans on social media. If the rumors are true, social media may be the only place to keep up with the Busby family. Adam recently responded to a fan about when the show will return. While he didn't confirm anything, he strongly hinted that the Quints no longer want to continue with the reality show. TLC has yet to comment on the future of Outdaughtered.